Good day, citizens. Welcome back to another one. <laughs> All right, this is our first time playing 323 or 3.23. I am here today with XCOMCAD X, aka COMCAD, and uh, super stoked about this. We've been waiting for this for so long, and uh, this is going to be a reaction video to what we're seeing. All right, so as you can see, I got my pirate outfit on. <laughs> Let's go ahead and meet up with COMCAD. This, you know what? It's a lot smoother now. <laughs> it's a lot smoother. One thing I'm really, really digging are these little symbols right here. Press F to sit or tap F. Uh, what do we got here? Gear storage. Oh, this is going to be the new way to access our storage. So instead of pressing inventory for I, uh, we're going to have to be going through here. Lots of stuff going on. Okay, let's do the bathroom test. All right, that works. Ooh, I don't remember this here last time. What? What? Oh, that's <laughs> that's where the shower is. Oh, I can't turn it on. This sucks. What about this one? Oh, the animation on this is nuts. Like, look at that. Uh, the big thing that I'm really concerned about not concerned about but i, I want to see is if we ended up getting or keeping our ships because the game's running so much smoother uh, like whatever they did they they did it right i'm really liking this uh, let's see f1 what oh my goodness moby glass is crazy ship information can i pick a different ship oh i can check if okay okay these are my ships what okay. oh it looks like i kept everything 890 jump yeah this is so so okay you know what the interaction on this is, is i'm loving this even more so you can check out the status of your ship before you get to it i'm really loving these like new mini maps man Two is for the station. Stand clear of disembarking oh, this is so cool. <laughs> okay, let's get into the sh into the shuttle. Yo, the shuttle's moving so much smoother now too, eh? Uh, super hard. Now let's do the Minimize Super Hornet. Select. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Hangar of Okay, so Xing is not working when I'm in inventory. I have to press I to close it. Oh, <laughs> you see. There you Yeah, I, saw, I just looked over. I'm like, I was about to say, I'm like, ooh, the door's open. And all of a sudden, I see your ship. <laughs> really? There we go. All right, cool. So I got my key binding done for master mode, which is nice. I'm liking the fact that. Uh, Forward proximity alert. Sorry, I was just listening to what the computer was saying. I'm liking the fact that uh, your throttle is cut back when you have your what's it called? Deck proximity alert. <laughs> We're like doing the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> that was actually pretty cool. Uh, anyways, like I was saying, I kind of like the fact that y your throttle is uh, cut back when you have your landing gear down. So when we put our landing gear up, as you can see, we are going faster. Mm. That's this. Oh my gosh. This ship looks nuts, man. Like the graphics and everything... Uh, Okay, go a little higher because remember the last time you were that close, you ended up like a uh, point more down. Ah, stop a little bit more up, right about there. Hold on, you were looking for zero zero one. Yeah, you got it. Okay, you ready? Okay, you ready? Oh, you just took off before me, dude. And now we get to flying together. Go F four and look behind me. 
Oh no, you're in front of me. It is. And I... Oh. Yeah, I'm coming up, I'm coming up. Let's see, hold on. A four. Yo! <laughs> this is so cool. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can find... We gotta stay close to the ground. And... I don't know how we're gonna find these animals. Uh, I think so. I think it's like anywhere it's green. I honestly don't know. Oh, there it is. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm gonna hit you. Okay, I just passed you. <laughs> oh, did you? Okay, so let's walk up to them. I'm gonna land right here. They're not. Landing gear deployed. I'm gonna sort of do, uh, like, use the ship as a barrier. Whoa, dude, they look, they look so cool. Yeah. That's that's a proper that's a proper alien spaceship. Oh nice. Okay, I got my Oh okay. Yeah, I remember. And uh your computer was having a really hard time. Dude, I have this sniper gun. Can I shoot one? Yeah. Yeah, you know what? That would have that would have been best. Like brought one ship and uh loaded up with some vehicles. Yeah, yeah, right in front of us. I have I I have Yeah, that uh, yeah. No, I have my I have my sniper gun and I kind of want to shoot one. Okay, you got Oh, what? He sees us. Oh, what, what, to your left, to your left, to your left. Really? There you go. Okay, one's down. By the way, apparently we can collect the horns and we can get money from them. Like, oh, jeez, jeez, jeez. They're not happy that the one guy's dead. Okay, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna switch over to my snipe. Yeah, for real. Oh. Where did he go? He went... Oh, he's running away, that's why. He's the, la he's the last one left. Done. He's down. They're freaky looking, eh? Like, I zoomed in with the with the F button, but oh, that's some serious teeth going on there, man. Oh, jeez. Oh, dude, and I'm liking the interaction now with, with getting into the ship. If I press and hold F, instead of having a list like before, I have like this little circle bubble thing, and I, it's, yeah, I can, and you just use the mouse to uh, point the direction you, you want to go by highlighting and the let go of F. These clouds, they're something else, man. Oh, wow. Okay, that's different. That's very different. You go directly behind the ship and you can hear the, the engines get louder. Very cool. Holy mac. The graphics is like crazy. Okay, so what I'm thinking here is that with a bigger ship is going to cause 
more surface water or water surface displacement. Meaning we should be able to get like a decent size wave. Yeah, I got vertical takeoff or hover mode. Ah, uh, we're gonna have to do it again. Oh, you saw water splashing. That's so cool. I'm gonna have to change the angle. Okay, one more time. Let's go work. Jeez. No, it's only splashing around and it's not making waves like how we saw it before uh, in just the videos. Uh, let's see what's going on over here with these chevrons. If we can find one of those pterodactyl looking birds, that'd be cool. Oh, I think we did. Did we? Yo, we did. What? Oh, so cool. Okay. Let's get out. They sound like pterodactyls. <laughs> what? Okay, let's get out. Oh, that is so cool. Is this a grenade launcher? I completely grabbed the wrong gun. That sucks. Oh, did I kill? <laughs> no way. That Don't tell me that actually worked. Where did they go? Where did they go? I don't see them. That's still cool. <laughs> so we hit three of our objectives, and that was to see two of the wildlife that came out and also check out the water. Unfortunately, right now, it was only two out of the three were spectacular to see. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. I'm, I'm not sure what happened, but anyways, just a new release of it. I'm pretty sure they'll do the necessary updates to make it work properly with the game, I guess. But uh, still, man, seeing that. I'm sorry, I don't remember the name of the of the two wildlifes, but seeing the pterodactyl bird thing and then also the four-eyed saber-tooth guy, yeah, those are pretty cool. All right, so that's it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, as always, this is the kind of thing you like. Also, with model trains, why don't you go ahead, think about subscribing. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so that way you are notified every time we release a new video. And also, if you like the video, give us a thumbs up. Until the next time, who knows, maybe we'll see you in the verse.